Hello guys, it's Wolfios here, and I am back with Axis and Allies 1942, and today we are going to be playing Germany and Japan, since in the last one we played the US, but yeah, I figured it'd be fun to do Germany and Japan, just to see if I can win as the Axis powers. So, USSR starts first. I don't really remember the exact rules per se of this computer version. I know the initial game, but okay, so the Soviet Union is making a big initial attack. Okay. Got some good defense. Hopefully this Yep, okay, so that isn't great, but ooh, that was not good. Yep, okay. So the tank's gone and yeah, no last defense. Okay, so that fell. Okay, the controls are a bit finicky, but... Ah, that ain't good. Okay, infantry and artillery is gone. And with these defending rolls, yikes. Oh wait, they stopped attacking. Okay. So we need to retaliate against that. And I don't quite know exactly how. So one thing we need definitely is tanks. We're also going to want some infantry. Probably a couple submarines, I'd presume, like one submarine. And then we'll get another piece of infantry, so... Yeah, that'll be good, I believe. Now, I would like to destroy... Hmm, so we need to have a very strong opening move. We're not going to do have it in Russia. Uh, other than maybe here. Because they did not defend that very well. Which kind of surprises me. So that's lucky. We're going to rush these guys up as well send those troops um and then we'll load that oh actually we can take that that'll get us some more income despite how insane that looks uh nope okay we wanna we wanna remove that we're going to send some planes to attack the ships down in the Caribbean Sea. That's an important move. And then we are going to send this plane to attack here. We're going to send this cruiser to attack here. And then two submarines and we might be able to actually wipe out a good portion of the British Channel Navy. I don't believe there will be any attacks we are we particularly need to do immediately. We don't have the forces for an Egypt invasion yet. So this will just be good setup. Okay, so we captured Iceland. Let's get these guys. Whoops. Carilia SSR. Okay. Oh, mm. Mm, what was that? Okay, they didn't hit. Fight on. There we went. Now, where was that roller first time? Okay, and they did not hit. 
So there's that. Okay, and then this is the next big one. This is the battle for the English Channel. Oh, okay, well, that isn't great. Okay, they didn't hit either. Mm. Okay. Okay, that ain't good. There we got. We got two hits. Okay, I'm lucky that thing isn't hitting. We can probably destroy it all now. Yes, there it went. So, with that, we destroyed the, the British Channel Navy. That is huge. That is a massive net loss for Britain. And then, yeah, that just happens as normal. And then this is another big one. Okay. Yep, sank it. Yep. Phew, okay. So, naval dominance for Germany is currently insured. We've crippled most of the Royal Navy. So, these guys are going to land here. We're going to push these guys up to here. You are going to hop in here and hop down there. Yep. Okay, that one doesn't quite have the forces required. Okay, no, we're not going to move that one here. We're going to move it here because America can do a really cheeky invasion of Morocco. Yeah, we're going to move it here. And move that here, as well as that there. We're going to reinforce Ukraine. So... Okay. Oops. Nope, can't do that then. Uh... Nope, okay, so that's all good. We're gonna keep most of the other stuff here, however. Well, we are gonna move these guys to France. These guys here. Oh, I've got a long-range bomber. Well, now I feel stupid. Okay, yeah, that should be good. Uh, make changes, actually. We are going to put two submarines here and blockade off Britain, hopefully. Okay, so mobilization. We are going to mobilize them. We're going to want probably most of the Navy in the Caribbean, if I had to bet. Okay, we're going to want the three tanks there. And yeah, the five infantry there. Okay. Okay, so that was a massive success. Now, let's see what Britain attempts to do. Because they're currently doing a combat move, but I'm not quite sure what they intend to do for combat. Okay, so they are attacking my Caribbean fleet. Not, mm, that is just not the Caribbean. Caribbean's way over here. <laughs> uh, have I been saying that this whole video? If I have, that's going to pain me rewatching this, like, immensely. Okay, so, yeah, they are attacking our Mediterranean fleets. Uh, 
Ah! That's what they're doing. They're attacking the Solomon Islands. Oops, my, why do I keep closing that out? Okay, I forgot they've got a British front. Okay, we're gonna need to worry about, I mean, mm, gosh, I can't do geography today. I forgot that they've got a Japanese front. Okay. Let's see, where's the next battle? There it is. Okay, so, to transport in a sub. And it would seem that we lost all that. Okay, so our Mediterranean fleet's crippled. Oh yeah, that isn't ideal. Oop, and there went my battleship. Oop. And without even taking down one fighter. Okay, well, we performed about as well as the historic Italian Navy, if not just a touch better. Wait, they're sending up a destroyer to attack here. Huh? Okay, well, that was a tactical oversight. Oh, and they took the Solomon Islands. That ain't good. Okay, so... We can unfollow them now. Let's see, what did they... Okay, so Japan... Is in a rough spot. Hmm. Hmm. Japan's gonna have a very hard opening we're going to need a navy, though. And preferably a factory. So we are going to want... We can probably get... Hmm, fighter would be good in, like, a infantry? Because I would like to get a factory into one of our main locations. So we are going to actually move the battleship in and attack here. We're going to move this here. I want to try and destroy the British fleet as soon as humanly possible. Though I also do need to worry about getting that Pearl Harbor invasion off. Send that there. Okay, let's see. What do we send to attack this? Okay, yeah, we sent a pretty sizable force. Uh. Hmm. Yeah, okay, so if we send. That there, that there. We might be able to get some payback on some of the British fleet. Um, it's going to be a very long shot, though. Okay, so we do have our planes that we can send back there. We're going to keep our battleship in position. We're going to load up. Uh, wait a minute. We're going to load that up, and we're going to invade uh, some of the Soviet Union. And we're going to send our destroyer down there. Um. Yeah, and then we're going to push here and try and see if we can make progress into China. Those are some good opening moves, I think. Okay. 
so let's get this attack on the British Navy out of the way. Okay. Right up here, missed. Not a poor shock. Okay. They do hit. Um. We'll lose one plane. Just because we don't want to lose an aircraft carrier. Okay. Still, an overall win for us. I would have preferred to have not lost a fighter, but. All things considered, that went okay. Okay. Miss. M mm. Okay, we hit. We hit. Okay, and no big shock here. They destroyed our destroyer. That's fine. An eye for an eye, or however that saying goes. Actually, we got more out of that. Okay. Then we're gonna invade here. See if we can push a little further into China. And we missed everything. Lovely. So did they. Oops. Press on. Mm, maybe that was okay, we're fine. Yeah, we can we can we can press on, definitely. Maybe not with these rolls. You have gotta be kidding me. There it went. What were those rolls early on? Okay, well that's annoying. But we did capture it. And all things considered, we had pretty good casualty rates. So, non-combat move, we're going to want to fortify that. We're going to want to move down here to fortify that up we are going to land them there move this guy here and this guy here. no actually we are going to move him there since we couldn't destroy the pacific fleet like i had wanted Okay, we're going to want to keep the battleship close to mainland Japan. I'm not happy about the failure of destroying the um, the one, uh, the Pearl Harbor Forest, but you know what happens. Now, we're going to want troops probably here to counter India's right. Uh, rise. So we're going to put that there and that there. And that'll be our turn. And hopefully that should be the longest one. Because generally speaking the first move is always the hardest. Okay. They did choose to attack the Solomon Islands again. But we did hit something. Oops. Didn't mean to close that. Alright, so they're definitely preparing something in Morocco. Okay, so Russia's doing something weird. No matter. We need probably more submarines, perhaps. And we're going to want... Um, infantry, probably. Like so. That should be good. When did I get two subs? Okay, whoops. Okay, we're gonna end industrial bomb Britain. 
I believe we might actually have the forces required to take Egypt. Hopefully. Strong. We're gonna send a fighter to deal with those. Yeah, we're gonna send a fighter to try and wipe those out. We're gonna send these guys down here. Okay. We're gonna blitz those. And uh, I'm trying to think of if we have the forces required. We might not. I might not want to do a blitz. That would probably put us in a dangerous position. Unless we go to here, in which case they might not be able to counterattack as quick. And you know what, we're going to throw in a cruiser down there for the heck of it. I just realized we really need to rebuild the Air Force is what we need to do. Okay, how many troops do I have here? I don't think I've got enough to take on any significant portion of Russia, per se. So this might be all the combat moves we can do. So, we're gonna try and bomb them first. So, unless they roll a one, which they didn't, thank goodness. Ooh, we did the best we could. So, we cost them six dollars that they can use next round, so that's a big positive. See if we win the Mediterranean. Also, I'm pretty sure I might have just called it the Caribbean again. I don't know why I keep doing that. I, I'm gonna blame it on sleep deprivation, like I always do. Okay. So, the Mediterranean fleets are just gone. There's nothing left. What about this fleet? Okay, let's hope these, oh, there it went. Yep. And of course they did hit something, but all in all, I think that might have been worth it. Yeah, that was worth it. Okay, got those, and then Egypt. Alright, so, miss there, no shot. Not the worst. Could have been a lot better. Their roll could have been a lot better. So, I'm grateful for that. Okay, that works. We definitely get Egypt. Yes, and no casualties. Okay. So the future rounds will be blitzing Africa because we have a very high probability of being able to take it. And they're more than likely planning something for there. We're gonna move this back. We're gonna move these guys up here, these guys up here, okay, this guy here, we might actually want to start moving all of our tanks towards the eastern front, not entirely sure how much I uh, trust just uh, I lost the point of what I was going to say. It's fine. Okay. So, yeah. We've more or less crippled the western front on their end, so we can probably focus more on the east. Hopefully that isn't just the ego that will eventually cost me the game. Now, here we're going to add more submarines there. Actually... Okay, wait. Mobilize two tanks there, and then two tanks there. Okay. Much better. 
All right, Germany had a successful run. Britain is bombing me, as per usual. Would expect nothing less. Oh, they also destroyed six. That is regrettable. Oops, oh, didn't mean to highlight them. Okay, now Japan, 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 Japan. We are going to need a navy. And badly. Oh, but they have presented us an opportunity against a American battleship. Which I did not think they would be courteous enough to do. Okay, we might want to take these guys out. As odd as that is. We're going to move one here just to take it okay Japan is not in a very good position all things considered uh Yeah, I don't believe I've got the forces needed to take any more of China than I have. Unless, of course... No, that wouldn't work. Okay, yeah. Yeah, I think we might be good. There's that. Let's check on the battleship. Uh, okay. Well, that could have gone a heck of a lot better. It's fine. If we destroy it here, we destroy the American Navy. Okay, well, that isn't ideal. There we go. Okay. Alright, so admittedly we lost more than we gained from that. That might not have been worth it. Okay, and then this. This little attack. Okay. So if we can destroy this, we basically eliminate most of the opposition to those tank blitzes I was doing. No way. Are you kidding? Ah, uh, dang it. Okay. Alright, Japan lost way more than any casualty we dealt. I'm... Uh, okay, we're gonna move that there. Um, Alright, so admittedly, this isn't the worst thing to ever happen. I don't believe. Okay. This area is kind of exposed, but it isn't as important. We're not gonna move it. Uh, got a lot of troops that I need to move, so we're gonna move these guys off. Yeah, there's like no navies left in the world. We've completely destroyed every navy that could have existed. That might be it. So we're gonna mobilize. Uh, we're gonna mobilize here. And then after that, we're gonna need to get some transports. So. All in all, not horrible. Let's see what the logistics are. Okay. So we are making more than every allied nation aside from America. Okay. So they did attack there. That isn't ideal, but... Could have been a lot worse. Hmm. Okay. 
Now, is Russia planning to do it? Okay, so they are going to try and take that back. I do want to stay tuned on this. Okay. Ow. Oops. Nope, hold on, get back in there. What was that? What was that defense? Ah, that was horrible. There it went. Finally, some good hits. Okay, well, that sucks. But we did get hits on. So this is going to hurt the Soviets quite a bit, I believe. Admittedly though, it did hurt us more. The Soviets are in a pretty good position. Hmm. And we're not particularly in a fantastic position to counterattack that. Hmm. We're not in a good position to counterattack a lot, are we? Okay, we're gonna need a lot of aircraft. Might need a bomber. Oh. Okay, so we purchased everything we can. And we're gonna repair it. We're gonna make one blitz here. Their blitz here. Wait. Whoops, hold on, I screwed this up. We're gonna move here. Oh wait, that's a Japanese unit. Can't use that in combat. I don't believe. Oh, they've left themselves very open. Hey, we might actually be able to advance here, because they've left Western Ukraine incredibly open. Oh, they brought back their fleet. Okay, we're going to attack that. Move in to attack this as well. I'm going to send a bomber to... I want more confirmation that we can win that attack maybe we really don't want the Americans to have a fleet in the Atlantic so we're gonna move these planes up and attack there okay now Take that. Uh, actually, might be in our best interest to not blitz Africa immediately. Though the additional manpower would be nice. I mean, not manpower, income. Mm, no, I think it's more important we advance on the middle. So we're going to advance into the Middle East there. That might be all we can do. So let's see here. Oh, wait. Yeah, I need to make changes here on this offensive. Okay, what is our... Yes, that is better. Alright, now we can begin our offensive. Uh, yeah. Should be okay. Let's check the naval conflicts first. Because we here on the Zulfeus channel hate everything navally related. 
Okay. Yeah. And we destroyed the American fleet. Without a single loss, actually. That is going to damage them a lot. And set back a lot of progress. So, with that, Africa should be secure. And submerged attack. And that was a complete mess. It's fine though, we hit with the planes. And they missed anyway, so. There we go. No harm, no foul. Let's get here first. Okay, well, that isn't a great start. Uh, that's fine, we're gonna keep fighting. Maybe we are gonna keep fighting. Yeah, now retreat. That wasn't worth it. Uh, retreat to... Okay, well that wasn't ideal. Uh, let's check this one. This one was our least likely to succeed, but if it does, it's massively helpful. There we go. Ow. We might, we can probably take it, yeah. Yeah, we lost a lot, but we did also take... We made a good advance. Now, let's do this one. This one will likely have the least amount of casualties. Honestly, though, I'm beginning to feel like we're not in a particularly stable position. Which isn't great. There we go. Infantry actually got the two kills. So, yeah, we're not particularly stable in our manpower supplies. However, it's not the worst. Now, this is going to be the, yeah, the worst to actually deal with. Okay, so they took out one of our planes. That's massive downside. Four. Take three hits on the infantry. We can probably press on a little bit. That dealt a lot of damage. Yeah, we can keep this up. And there we go. That was a massive success. Okay, so now these guys are going to retreat to here. And retreat this guy to here as well. Now move a couple infantry down there. I don't know how much else we can do. I suppose we have two troops sitting on Iceland. And we have the entire war. Fantastic. I've had two infantry I could have been using for any other productive purpose. Oh well. Alright, bombing raid. Not horrifically shocking. Okay, that glitched out, so we're just gonna let it do its thing. Or maybe. 
Okay. Five dollars lost. That isn't great. Okay, they did. Yeah, that's becoming kind of concerning. We might want to place a factory down in Egypt before long. Now, as for this, we're going to want something to continue a land offensive. Because America doesn't have a Pacific fleet. So the most we're going to get is a transport. And then the rest is going to be tanks. Since those seem to work very well for us. And... There we go. Tanks seem to work very well for us in the... Uh, one... Yes, Germany. That's that one country I can't think of the name of. That isn't at all concerning. We're gonna take that. Okay. We also really need an air force. Japan is currently very, very weak. We're gonna assist up there. We're gonna try and kill these two. That might be all we can do. I don't think we can really do much as Japan, realistically. Because there's really no combat areas. Wait. Those two planes are there. Okay. That wasn't particularly something I expected. And we're gonna hold, so... Really, the only combat is up here. Then maybe we can turn around and focus on the east. There we go. So, there's that. Yeah, that amounted to basically nothing. Um... Yeah, I don't know what else we can really do here. Oh yeah, these guys need to retreat. We're gonna move them um, here. Just to make them suffer a bit whenever they do try and retake that, so... We're gonna actually move this here, I believe. And then move this here, so... Now we can put one transport in the water. We're going to want to put the rest here. Actually, we're going to want to put tanks here. Alright, and then, uh, yeah, one more tank. There we go. Yeah, Japan is looking rough. I figured they would be attacking here. Okay, so... They've actually get elected for a one-on-one -on -one combat here, which is kind of an odd choice to me, but they probably outnumber us, so. So that wasn't great. Uh, Soviets have actually elected to attack Japan. They haven't made a move against Germany. Okay, so yeah, Japan's currently our weakest front. It's not at all what I was hoping for. But honestly, Japan just seems to be in a rough situation overall anywho. So, the fact that we're actually doing as well as we are might be good. It's rough. Okay, so they're mass producing troops there. Ah. 
We are going to want... Oh yes, we're going to want a factory. And we are going to want tanks. And we're also probably going to want a bunch of... Uh, Uh, let's get some subs. Subs are helpful to have around. Because we want to make sure that there is no naval opposition to us. Okay, we're flying preemptive strikes everywhere. Uh, fly up there. Wait, no, hold on. I don't want to fly those guys up there. That is kind of pointless. We're going to blitz to here. That might help secure the position. We could also try and move on India. However, we don't have much here. Yeah, no, this isn't great, per se. I'm gonna bomb that. We are actually going to move on the offensive here. Okay, it's a bomber versus... Uh... No, we don't want to move the bomber all the way out there to attack that. We might not want to move it at all. Truth be told, we're actually going to go and bomb the Soviets. Because they're producing stuff and... Yeah, this might be okay. It's not a lot of very good offensives, though. So we're going to bomb Moscow. Okay, that's good, no hit. And pretty good damage on their factory. Let's try out this one. Okay, and we did one. That isn't ideal. Okay, and then let's see about this lovely naval conflict. Because we really don't want Britain to have a navy either. Nobody can have a navy besides me and my way too large U boat fleet. Okay, yeah, I... Why did I buy more submarines? I don't need five. I really just don't need five. No, I will admit, not having America interfere here is nice. So, let's see up here. Fantastic. Even better. Okay, so that's, yeah, we, that was worth it, I'd say. We're going to move this back to here, and we're going to start moving that up. Yeah, we're going to move a lot of forces here, fighters. We're gonna go there. Bomber. Whoops, that isn't our bomber. Our bomber. We want our bomber. We're gonna have them move there. And we're not gonna move them anywhere. Hmm. Okay, yeah, that should be all good to go. So, we're going to want an industrial complex. 
and I'd like it to be in Egypt, but I think we might have waited too long there. We're going to put it here. No. Uh. Actually, how good are they? They're not actually all that well defended. We're gonna put, we're gonna move them to France, actually, and we're going to put a lot of troops in here, and yeah, that should be good. The decision to purchase a factory might not have been our best one, however, and they're bombing us. Okay then. Wait, oh, they're moving on Burma. That ain't good. Alright, so they are wanting to concentrate British forces in very odd positions. Now, we are going to definitely need a lot of infantry. And we're gonna take two fighters. Okay, load up. Wait, so these guys are gonna load up here. And attack there. We're gonna have the battleship assist. We don't have planes. We have no planes. We theoretically could move them here and get that, but that might be a waste. They're... I don't really know where to move those. Yeah, Japan's just kind of stuck. Okay, so Manchuria is about the only thing we're going to actually be doing. Oh sweet, we actually hit the bombardment. They hit us. That isn't great. Okay, so battleship is going to move. Uh That's actually a good question. The battleship isn't going to move. Um Yeah, this isn't a fantastic position. We can't really move any troops. Unless we move these guys. We're gonna move them up. And then we are going to go to the next phase and let's see what we can put down. Mm, we could use some planes. That might make better defense. We're going to lose more money if they actually do choose to attack it. However, it's also going to cost them more money. Okay, let's see what they do. Okay, so they actually elected to move there. And bomb Germany. We're going to actually need to start making repairs to our factories, which is not ideal. I feel like we should be able to have a big breakthrough somewhere. Are you kidding? Uh, that's painful. Okay, so everything is there. We're gonna need to repair all of this. There we go. We're gonna want a transport. Say a couple. We're gonna want a lot of air force. We're gonna try and invade Britain. 
and maybe, hopefully, we're going to try and completely eliminate, uh, Germany, I mean not Germany, we're not wanting to eliminate Germany here, we're going to want to, uh, actually can I do Blitz, and then into here. Okay. We're gonna launch almost everything at Moscow. And we're gonna see what sticks. And then we're going to realize that our infantry up there is worthless. Okay. Good to know. Okay. Let's see how the naval battle goes first. Hey. We actually we got away with that. I'm kind of shocked. And here's the hard one. If we take this, they might just be out of the war. Okay. 7 hits. 10 hits. Okay. We're gonna want to keep most of our tanks in here. There we go. Uh, we might need to pull out. Yeah. We do not have the forces needed to take Russia. That was not great. Yeah, that wasn't. That was a very, very bad offensive. Okay, well, that could have gone a heck of a lot better. Um, we're gonna move them down there. And let's see. Transports, we're gonna want some... Uh, actually, no, we're not. Take that back. Remove those. They're gonna go up here. Oops. Um... Uh, this is not great. We needed to buy tanks. However, they are choosing to advance through Africa rather than attack the Soviet front. So we might be okay, but this is not an ideal position. We might actually start to lose something here we need air force and bad we need Can't do that, we need to load these up. Now... Let's see if we can actually get this back. How likely is that offensive?
Actually, yeah, that isn't a grand. Actually, yeah, it is. We're gonna need to. Okay, we're gonna send both. Yeah, no, that's. I do think we actually do have the advantage here, so we're going to send them all down here. And we're going to pop on a tank. Download that there. No, we aren't. Take that back. We're going to unload artillery because that gives the infantry a boost. So, put that on. And actually, we're going to advance into Manchuria to get and come back. And yeah, we're going to just have to pray that we get lucky. Which, uh, we've had some weird luck. Oh, okay then. Honestly, I'll take that. So, we got that. America still hasn't made up a Pacific Force, so, yeah, there's no real point. Uh, yeah, we're gonna move them here, we're gonna get, no, no, we're not, we need these guys there, just as extra defense. So, they're there. Yeah, no, there's not much we can do here. We're getting fighter planes and a sub. That's about all we can do. However, all things considered, that wasn't a horrid round. Okay. Oh, they're attacking our fleet again. Try to reload it. Yeah, okay, that works. That was weird. Okay. All of a sudden, I'm glad for that massive fleet I've made. Okay, now. Yeah, this isn't fantastic. I'm not gonna lie and say that it is. Honestly, I know our original plan was to invade. Uh. Initially, it was to invade Great Britain. However, we just don't have the supplies for it, or the troops for it, more accurately. And we're gonna fly... Uh, no, wait. No, we're not. We're going to fly only, like, two down there. We're only gonna use like two. Cause I I only wanna stop their advance in Egypt. I don't particularly wanna leave the Caucasus undefended. Yeah, I think that's good. Let's see how this goes. So, Cause we're gonna need to soften Russia up quite a bit. You've gotta be kidding. And it 
it didn't do much damage. That's regrettable. We lost more than we gained. Let's see about Egypt. There we go. Alright, well, that wasn't particularly worth the money. However, they're not advancing, so we are getting income. Okay. I should have written Drew. Yeah, okay, retreat. That was not a good round. Truth we can muster here. Okay. We'll need to get transports and we can try and reconquer some of Africa. Okay. Most of our navy is gone. And they are definitely not going to be friendly. We need tanks. We need aircraft. And we'll get some infantry. Who's battling here? Okay, we might be able to conquer back most of China, possibly. Yeah, no, that's about as good as we can do as Japan. I think, yeah. Should be worth it. And again, another infantry loss, but we got plenty of it, so. All in all, Japan kind of was a success where Germany proved to be a failure. So, I'm relatively happy. We're going to move them here. Okay, that should be good. Oh yeah, I can mobilize units. Forgot about that. We're gonna want more tanks. And a fighter. And a couple infantry. What we need is transports, now that I think about it, for Japan. We're actually building up a fairly sizable force in Japan. Mainland Japan, at the very least. Now that I think about it, there is potential here. Because America has been relatively underdefended, just like Paris has apparently been underdefended. Oh, no, that, that ain't good. Okay, so that went to them. Uh, that ain't good. I 
I'm beginning to wonder if we're gonna win this. We might actually end up losing. I don't... We actually attack with all of our forces here. How many does that end up being? This would be a particularly good attacks here. This might be the best one we got. It's right at the coast. And we are definitely... Well... Yeah, no, that might be the best job we got. Yeah, no, never mind. These guys, it's saying it's improbable. Now I think about it, the stats are incredibly low. Might be able to destroy something here. Okay, never mind. I misread the map. This is a good position for us to attack. Send a British chance. Let's wipe out the American fleet there. It probably won't do as much as I'm hoping it does, because America's actually amassed the fleet in the Atlantic somehow. Okay. Okay, well. You'll have that, but overall it was a success. We're going to need an AV eventually, but currently we just don't have the manpower for it. Let's see if we can knock Russia out of the war. If we can, that would be massive. Okay. Nine hits. Oh, well, you'll have that. Press on. There we go. Seven hits. Okay, four hits. I think we might be able to press on here. Yes, we got it. Alright, so we took Moscow. And that is a massive win. So we're gonna move that there. And there's not much to remaneuver anymore. So we're going to mobilize four inventory there. Get three there. Uh, two. Ah, we might need to leave it to Japan to take care of the rest of it. So we're gonna mobilize the rest there because we gotta take France back. So there's that. Alright, so they're attacking the rest of our submarine fleet. I don't think we've got any more U boats. Yeah, and it looks like we already lost, so. a lot of transports. Yep, and some infantry, of course. Okay, we're gonna move. We're gonna blitz up to here. Gonna grab that. Move the 
battleship up. Just to take it. And we're gonna blitz that as well. Okay, so they're mobilizing there. We're gonna probably wanna preemptive strike that. We're gonna... This looks good. Uh, actually. If we take those out, and we move down towards that. Yeah. Okay, so that's gonna be a big offensive. Unless we miss. Oh well, they missed too, so there we go. And they hit, but however, we did conquer a good portion. I think now that that's done, all of Russia might be under our control again. So that leaves only this. And that's just to make sure that they're not in, they don't have the strength to attack the caucus those again. I think it's called the Caucus Mountains, actually, now I think about it. Okay. Nope, don't take any of those. Oh, wait. I'm dumb. Yeah, we want one on this guy. There we go. So we wiped out the attacking force there. We're going to want to retreat them up here. We're going to want to move these guys here. Actually, no. Here might be better. We're going to want them there. Them here. We're going to start to move everything this way. I believe that might be the best we can do. Okay. Japan was a massive success. Alright, so Western Europe is falling very rapidly to the Allies. So that makes me believe I uh, I need to act quick. Uh, it's gonna be a very unstoppable force soon. And yeah, the Soviets are done. We're gonna need a lot of air power. We're gonna need a lot of tanks. Okay, cause... And I would like to get rid of this. Little pocket of British resistance. And then, nope, that's in there. Gonna attack there. Yeah, okay. Let's get this out of the way. Because once this is out of the way, we might be on route to attack India. Ah, I missed the double button. Yeah, and we win this. There we go.
and then here. Okay, that wasn't great. I would, we can probably press on. Eh, that might not have been a great idea. Uh, but we can... Yeah, there we go. Since we came so far, we could, yeah, win it. So we'll just take it. It's less territory and ultimately more money that we gain, but still it's not great by any means of the word. We're going to want to move this back to Germany, and we're going to want to move. We're going to move these guys up here to provide more defense there. And then we're going to put a lot of air force here. Four tanks. And a fighter. Okay. Wait. Oh, that's how strong India is? I never realized that. They really don't have much there. Unless... No, no, they have a lot of points. And they know our plan, too, so that's also regrettable. Okay, no matter. Um, I believe we got transports. We're going to want probably some bombers. And we're going to want to... Uh, well, minus one bomber, because we're going to want another battleship. I believe, hopefully, that this could be a very, very massive invasion of America. So, we don't want to come through there. There's actually more defense up in Alaska. We're going to move them there, and we're going to start attacking everything here. We're going to... I believe that will be the best. We're going to move that there. Uh, we're not going to move that there. No, we're not going to move either of these here, because that would be pointless. We're going to blitz that. And then we are going to send. We're going to send attack forces down to here. And that might help us. Okay. Uh, actually, no. Hold on. We're going to move them down there as well. Midway is a key part here. If we win at Midway, the western coast is open. And our weak link of the Axis Alliance might actually end up saving us. Okay, well that wasn't great. But we won. So. And honestly, with enough casualties to spare. We could also attack Alaska. Alaska would also be a very valuable position, because I believe it's also a victory city. Okay, well that wasn't what I wanted. We're gonna press on and see how much of this we can take out. Okay, yeah, that's... Yeah, we're gonna retreat. Okay. They're going to move here. This is going to move up here. 
and they're going to land there and we are going to move them here and then we're going to move this guy here and this guy here as well no wait we don't want that we want that here the bomber here we're going to add two infantry there it's not a great defense on Southeast Asia. However, it might be okay. Okay, and we forced them to redirect their focus back onto Northwestern Europe. So currently they're not focused on attacking Germany. So, all in all, that's a positive. So that was America's move. They haven't yet taken notice of our offensive. Never mind, they have. And they're unloading a crap ton of infantry on it. Hmm. Now that would be problematic. The Soviets are gone. There's nothing they can do. So we are going to want. We need something. We're gonna need a lot of navy, and we're gonna want a lot of tanks. Or maybe not tanks. We're gonna want infantry. Okay, so we're not gonna do anything there. We're gonna... Uh, we're just gonna bomb the UK. Oh, they don't actually have that much defending. They don't have much defending France, actually, now that I think about it. And we can probably afford to take that since we are deploying 9 infantry. Okay, and then we're going to attack here. Though, that is actually a bad offensive. That would be suicidal. Okay, so we're not going to do that. That is going to be our main attack, is against France. America is definitely hard carrying. Alright, that was actually a pretty good bombing run, all things considered. Okay. Alright, and time for the big one. <laughs> oh gosh, what was that? Oh wait, never mind, we win. Melodramatic, that's fine. Ow. Alright. So they've they are still holding Northwestern Europe, but all things considered, we've taken back a lot of what we need. So we're gonna retreat these guys. These guys are gonna move here. And that'll be it. Now we're gonna prepare a massive navy here. And because uh, all nine are gonna go there. So we're gonna put the other two up top. That's about the best we're gonna get. Okay, so... Hmm, that ain't good. Alright, so upon looking back, 
we've got a chance to win this, I believe. I don't think we're gonna get to do the invasion of America that we want, but we can capture Hawaii. That'll be good. We just need to make sure that... Oh. But we're gonna need to move troops there. Now that I think about it. We might want to get industry. Uh... Hmm. That ain't good. We're gonna want. We're gonna want transports, and we're also gonna want more infantry again. Yeah. Cause we're all gonna load up here, and we are going to invade Hawaii because that is how I believe we're going to win this. We're gonna start moving troops. Actually, we're gonna attack here. I think that might be what we need to do. Okay, so bomber there. That'll be a positive. Okay. All right. Hawaii is ours, and I believe that's a victory city. So, with that, we might have actually won the game. I know we need to hold on to it, but I don't believe unless China falls that there's anything that the allies can do to reverse it. Okay, yeah, retreat. There's no point in that. We're gonna wanna move them here. That'll serve as a very valuable buffer zone to that. And we're gonna wanna move these guys down here. Just to ensure that Hawaii cannot fall. Okay. Honestly, that was a massive success. What's America doing? Okay, so America didn't... Oh, we just went. Alrighty. Well, guys, um, that's going to be the end of the longest video on the channel so far. So, if you guys stuck around, I hope you all enjoyed it. If you didn't, comment down below and do better. And uh, yeah, I will talk to you all in the next video.